to watch the full lecture of all subjects kindly subscribe to my youtube channel and press the bell icon because whenever i post the new videos you will get the immediate notifications hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel in this particular video let us solve a third problem that question is on the screen please take the screenshot of the question calculate leverages from the following data the sales is 1 lakh units at rupees 2 per unit then the variable cost is 0 0.70. Okay, fixed cost is 1 lakh rupees. Then interest charges are 3668 rupees. So here we need to calculate leverages. Means all three leverages we need to calculate in this particular problem. E problem only leverages na calculate maana dikhe hiri dare. Agagi yalla leverages. All three leverages na abu E one do idhari find out maana beka karte. Now. First, always we need to write the sales. Here directly they are not given the sales value. We need to calculate the sales. We direct the sales na hagagi now calculate the Total units sold is 1 lakh into units sold is rupees 2 per unit. So you will get 2 lakh. 1 lakh units na sale maadi dare. Atrali, yeah, one the unit na yer rupee ke sale maadi thare. Haan ki two lakhs namke sales value sigute. Less. Idhar ei na wo variable cost na minus maad be karte. Total unit sold is to one lakh. Total unit sold is one lakh into variable cost per unit is how much? Zero point seven zero rupees. One lakh in units na variable cost per unit test bhi dite zero point seven zero units. So you will get that is. 7 lakh sorry 70,000 next if you do all these things so it is subtract we will get contribution how much is a contribution 1 lakh 30,000 next for this we need to subtract Fixed cost. This is fixed cost na minus marve kagate. Fixed cost is to 1 lakh rupees. Fixed cost na minus marta ka nam gain sigate. EBAT or we call it as operating profit. Yes to 30,000. From that we need to deduct interest. This is now interest na subtract marve ko. Interest charges are 3668 in the question ali. With marta ka nam gain sigate. EBT. This is in the karate way. Earnings before tax EBT. So 30,000 ali 3668 na minus madre 26,332 answer. Next step they have asked us to calculate the leverages. So calculation of leverages. Leverages na calculate mana kidare. First one is operating leverages. So Operating leverages formula no na. Operating leverage formula. Can anybody please put the operating leverage formula in the comment box? Operating leverage is contribution divided by EBIT. So, what is the total value of contribution? It is 1 lakh. 30,000 contribution in a value 1 lakh 30,000 rupees EBIT yesterday EBIT 30,000 so 1 lakh 30,000 divided by 30,000 Martaga 4.33 barate so 4.33 times OLS to operating leverages is 4.33 times next we need to calculate the financial leverages financial leverage so formula for finding financial leverage is EBIT by EBT so EBIT is to 30,000 EBT is 26,332 EBIT is 30,000 EBT is 26,332 so when you divide that we will get financial leverages so 30,000 divided by 26,332 is 1.14 times 
So financial leverages is 1.14 times. Next step we need to calculate the last leverage that is combined leverage. Combined leverage. The formula to find the combined leverage is contribution divided by EBT. Contribution divided by EBT. Contribution is 1,30,000 and EBT is 26,332. So, 1,30,000 divided by EBT is 26,332. When you divide this, we will get CL. CL is nothing but combined leverage. So, 1,30,000 divided by 26,332, we will get 4.94 times. So, I will show the screen, take the screenshot of the answer. First, we need to prepare the income statement. Income statement, we will get the contribution EBIT and EBT. With that, first, we need to calculate the operating leverages. In this problem, we have got operating leverage as 4.33 times. Second, we need to calculate the financial leverages. Financial leverages, we have got 1.14 times. Then, the combined leverage is 4.33. 9-4 times. Hope you have understood this problem very well. If you have understood, please put in the comment box that you have understood. At the same time, if you have any doubts or queries regarding this particular problem, you can please post your doubts and queries so that I will respond to your doubts as soon as possible. Thank you for watching the video. I will come back with the next video. If you have any queries regarding today's session, kindly send your queries to education.mbbroadcast at gmail.com.